all talking about here is the possibilities and the new affordances of uh, a digital way of communicating that in, in fact says no, what we do, what we are as teachers and as scholars has a real impact on the world because guess what? The world has a real impact on us. Mm -hmm. You know, that it's, a, it's the bi-directional um, force where our teaching, no matter what we're teaching, whether it's computer code or intellectual property law or the culture of Haiti or slave rebellions in the 18th century or you know, whatever the field or management theory, whatever the field is that we're teaching, we're aware that that teaching doesn't exist in some kind of pristine way. It's always being changed by what's happening in the world and what's happening now and being able to put that into our work with a kind of um, immediacy and knows that, know that our students can do that and can contribute immediately changes the whole role, not right. only in terms of the hierarchy, but the, I think the importance of teaching mm -hmm. and the importance of what, of what learning is. And especially in this world where there's so much information right. and not necessarily even, especially for K through 12, very little education is spent teaching kids how to, to understand the knowledge they can get. They get knowledge like crazy, then they get into the schoolyard and they have to, in the schoolroom, they have to turn off all their devices, right? right? Most, most schools are in a state, state of digital lockdown right now. Um, you know, if you have a computer, you have a walled off computer with very limited access to the world because the world is scary. Well, that doesn't prepare kids for the world. It doesn't prepare anyone for the world. Um, and so I think what we're all talking about in different ways is how education can no longer be out of the world but be intensely part of the world in both directions, yeah. both receiving and giving back and being part, just being integral and part of that world.